Hi Virgo, I hope you're doing well. So we'll be looking at whoever you're thinking about here for the rest of the year. Aquarius here, uh, Gemini, Libra, and Aries, uh, Scorpio, Sagittarius, Pisces. Um, yeah, we have Aries here a couple of times, Aquarius here a couple of times. Doesn't have to be, but that's the energy they're bringing towards you. Um, this seems to be a third party, possibly. We do have our first, one of our cards was married with children. Careful not to get entangled with an unhappily married man. Don't allow yourself to be second place. This won't resonate with everyone, so we'll... The emotions part should resonate with most of you, but um, this one is a quite a specific message for a few of you. Um, this person is focused on you for sure, but they're hiding um, how they feel. I see for their feelings, I'm, I'm seeing a lot of blue here um, with a bit of passion. So a bit of a cold uh, hearted person in some manner. Um, bit selfish as well um but there's a lot of um passion this person wants to um take that risk towards you but this knight of pentacles this very cautious energy it's a, it's a bit of a standstill as well this knight moves very slowly um so they do want to jump into a relationship um with you or if they've a uh, physical connection for sure but they're, they're holding themselves back. And if they are married, they are kind of heal uh, that uh, relationship um, with their uh, respective spouse. But they're keeping you a secret here. Um, the, on the outside, this person appears to be, um, could be an authority figure, but someone in control of themselves, wise, uh, could be older than you. But behind that, we have, Four of Pentacles, Ace of Wands, Knight of Wands, Eight of Wands. So all that fire. And we had Mars, Sagittarius, more fire. So this person is burning uh, with desire for you. Um, though they're not showing it, they're trying to keep their passion under control. And then we have the lovers here. So again, talks about a strong sexual chemistry, but we have fear of commitment. Um, so this person is a non-committal. Mars and Sagittarius is flighty energy as well. Um, this person does have a lot going on in their life. So their focus is in a lot of um, different areas as well, which is coming uh, through strongly. But this person is a very much aware of what they are doing and they know that they have some healing to do. Um, could be inner child issues, but they're well aware that they um, have shadow work to do but perhaps that is why they're holding themselves back from you i'm not sure but they want to charge towards you with mars mars and sagittarius um, but let's clarify with the mixed emotions this person does want to be friends with you though Yeah, if they're in a marriage, they, they feel trapped. We are powerless. But they're un their ego, very strong ego, so they're unwilling to uh, admit that they have some, uh, they have a problem here because, oh, emperor, proud, honored, satisfied, pleased, yeah. This, this person refuses um, to be vulnerable um, in regards to you but see how the the tiger wants to uh, come forward as i was saying with that fool but the knight of pentacles something's slowing them down their hands are tied they can't come towards you but the, they're very much attracted
who we have a loving, devoted, affectionate, tender, jealous, receptive. If they're with someone else, then you feel jealous. There's two figures here and there's one, someone peeking on the couple there. But you're open uh, to this person if they decide to come back. I'm not sure that's the... Well, use your own judgment, but this person doesn't have the best energy. Um, we have two messages from them. I want to reach out to you, but you send me mixed signals. I want to be certain you want me to. So they could be waiting for some sort of confirmation from you to come forward. And then we have, what can I say? I'm a player and I want to continue to play the field. Yeah, this, this person, they're, they're, there's a mental connection. They're mentally intrigued, physically intrigued, but they don't want to. There's a lack of commitment here if that's what you want of a fun, flirty connection, then um, this person can provide that. But they're, they're deciding to keep their desire for you um, hidden. Advice for you, so we have hopes and dreams. Focus on your dreams with positive thoughts and in intentions. Dream big and believe in yourself. Your heartfelt desires are beginning to manifest. So I think your focus... Uh, should or will be on other uh, aspects of your life and you will see progress um, in other areas but we also have as your advice number 30 the juggler so it could be literally we have two fools this person could be a literal a fool um, very immature energy but i'll read this to you Many projects in the air, aspirations and inspirations everywhere, action to take, commitments to make, and yet another one will soon join the fray. Say yes, do not delay, it will all work out in the perfect way. The juggler lets you know that you are going to manage all that is going on in your life if you remember to stay present and relax. Deal with what is immediately happening and not worry about any other distractions. The more you do this, the more your juggling skills will improve. You'll not only handle all that's currently going on, but when another opportunity heads your way, you'll add it to the mix with grace, rather than ending up with egg all over your face. So yes, um, I think you have a lot of other um, things on your plate as well, uh, which you need to focus on. Um, so yeah, that's what I have for you, Virgo. Take care of yourself. If this resonated, do like and comment. Otherwise, I will see you later. Bye.